Welcome to Alchemy with Bronwyn, a podcast dedicated to helping you live an inspired, heart-centered life by cultivating energetic mastery. We delve deep into how to organize our life force around what matters most. I'm your host, Bronwyn Isla, board-certified acupuncturist, mama, dancer, and practitioner on the path of illumination. Let's take a few deep breaths together. Letting the spine be tall. Neck is long. Breath is deep. Breaths are lengthening. Each inhale slightly longer. Exhale slightly longer. Feeling the back of the lungs filling up. Tuning into this thinning of the veils that happens this time of year. of the ancestors of those that have passed feeling this vast network of support connecting us through time to those that have come before those lineage holders the grandmothers and grandfathers. Those that are gathering around here to check in on us, assist us, remind us, bring us the gift of the teaching of death. The teaching of the passage of time, the teaching of endings, and also the teaching of the infinite, the life force that moves beyond and through and around and in between life embodied in this single lifetime. Let's take a moment to allow our, if you, if you choose, to allow our boundaries to soften, to allow in more fully the influence of these ancestors. And you may notice this physically as a softening of the pores on a cellular level as the opening of the membrane. On a heart level, as a softening of the protection around the heart. On an intuitive level, as a softening between the eyebrows, a widening of the pineal gland. an opening of the first eye, intuitive eye. No need to know anything about it, just opening to the frequencies, the receiving, the lineages to weave, meander, come in, pay attention.
all of those grandmothers and grandfathers that were standing on the shoulders of. And you may in your mind's eye in this moment recall some of their names, any of the names that you know of your mothers, 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 mother. And your fathers, 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 father. And any other other names that you know in your family, first names, last names. If you have any gravestones that you visited, just recalling these images, these felt senses. Places they lived and walked and roamed and grew food. The journeys they made. of these ancestors, the intentions and the goodwill and the good way of these beings that prayed us into this moment. Take this moment to become fully present of the ground you sit on, the home you tend, the children you love, the elders you care for. Feel yourself surrounded by these beings, these ones that came before us, these ones holding us, coaxing us to choose well in our lives, guiding us, opening the way for us, working behind the scenes to arrange our lives. Letting the breath move deeply into the body like the breath of life, the Ruach. The breath, the continuity of these ancestral breaths. This life passed on from one generation to the next. Notice yourself with an ancestor that you feel troubled with. You can just skip to the next one in line, the next one behind that. Feel the support of the 
the ancestor in a good way, holding you, praying for you. This crystalline web of support. Feel it in your bones, your blood, tissue, heart. Be a connected human. Let's take a moment to tune into the ancestors whose names we have forgotten. In the Dagara lineage, these are called the Nanping, the ancestors of the ancestors of the ancestors. Going back thousands of years and feeling into the support of these beings, these ancient beings, these beings who have become like the wind and the rain, who speak to us through dreams and frequencies. Powerful influence like sparkling Sparkling light. With the trees and the stones. Feel a steady uncomplicated support of these ancestors. Feel yourself tall, noble, clear, connected. Some of these ancestors were great warriors, great healers, great song carriers, great shamans, great adventurers, great mothers, great fathers. brilliant storytellers. Feel them filling up your breath. Allow them in.
And from this state of consciousness, you may notice that there's some information coming through about an offering that you can make to the ancestors. Perhaps it's a song, perhaps some ash, some flowers. Let your consciousness open to receive this instruction now from these beings. Sit some ash, some water. Making an internal commitment to be in a good way of offering these beings your reciprocity. See the place where they want you to offer this. Perhaps it's a tree or a mountain. Maybe it's your backyard or your altar. Take a few more deep breaths into the full capacity of the lungs. Feeling the lungs like a warm cocoon around the heart. Or just soft. Feel this feeling of being connected and held in the tissues, the belly. Let those codes of deep gratitude pour into the system in remembering and honoring these wise ones that came before us. Continue to be strong and full. Supported and soft. Held and connected. Thank you for tuning in to Alchemy with Bronwyn, this podcast which is dedicated to helping you live an inspired, heart-centered life by cultivating energetic mastery. We delve deep into how to organize our life force around what matters most. Send me a message. You can do that in the show notes. You'll see a link. Let me know how it went for you. Also, please remember to hit the like button, support button, all the rest of it. And you can support me to make more great content for people everywhere at bronwyn.love. That's B-R-O-N-W-Y-N 
www.mindfulnutrition.love. All those links are in your show notes. Many blessings and I hope to tune in with you again soon. Mm-hmm.